Car here. Today on Power BI, we're going to be talking about the drill down donut chart in the Power BI marketplace. And we're going to go straight to this drill down chart by Zoom charts. So to do that, we want to go ahead and get more visuals from the Power BI marketplace. We want to just type in donut. Once we type in donut, we're going to get quite a few things here. The one we're looking for is the drill down donut chart pin, which is by Zoom charts. So we're just going to click on that one. Once you click on that, you're going to see some of the visuals they have here to just kind of show you some of the features real quick. And then you can kind of read through some of the main pictures, main features and the most popular use cases. And this will also let you know what version it is and the last time it has been updated. And the last time it was updated was actually on 12-15-2022. So we can go ahead and click add here. It's Power BI certified as you saw there. You will update it to the latest version. Click OK. Once that comes in, it'll look like this. You just expand this across your report view. And this one is pretty cool. I really like this one a lot. And we're going to start out with product category. And our product category, I want to go ahead and eliminate my food and spices. And after that, we want to go and select our sales values. So right now, if you go ahead and select anything, it's just going to give you that sales value and you're basically getting a percentage. We can come here to a format visuals and do some customizations. But in order to do that, you have to get that full version. So you're limited to the percentage as of now. And you also get your totals in your tooltips when you do hover over a product category. So I'll just go ahead and minimize the filter. And now I'm going to go back to our data visual. In addition, to our product category we can also add region or we can stack our region on the top so if we wanted to go region first now we see where it's northeast west midwest and south but when we click into the south region now we see a breakdown of what the sales look like from all the product categories if you wanted to drill down a little deeper and let's just say we want to add in the states after the region Let's just say we want to go to South region and now we want to look at all the different states in that South region and we want to say, well, let me, let's look at Texas. Once we look at Texas, now we'll see the breakdown of the product category. Now you see how this drill down donut chart works. And if you want it to go ahead and drill back up, you can come here, just click on Texas. This will take you back to the states and then you can come here and this will take you back to the region. Now, as far as my experience with this, you are limited to just three different categories. I've tried to add city to this and if I do that, nothing happens. But if I get rid of product category and then I come here to add city, now we see city there and I can come here into the, the states. And once we go to the states, we can go to Georgia. Let's go to Georgia. And then we'll get to see the sales for those different cities in the state of Georgia from the south region. If we wanted to go all the way back, we can just hit this arrow here. This arrow will take us all the way back to the region. And like I said, we can get rid of city and we can add back in our product category. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you use drill down donut chart in Power BI.